Hello everybody and welcome to my Minecraft Let's Play video here with Fuzzy Kitty. And we're going to be picking up where we left off in which we ended up finding our little doggy, which I have yet to come up with a name with. Maybe today we'll end up figuring out that name. Okay, so now I just want to bring back my little icon. Oop, wrong thing. Okay, let's give the puppy some loves. Okay, so what we were last doing is that we were building this little doggy room. I know we haven't really gotten that far yet in it. I mean, for heaven's sake, there's this uh, little bit of a, a furnace just kind of here, but it looks like I missed a spot. There we go. And I know I did it in two separate types of wood. I think we have spruce wood over here, and for the doghouse, I believe I did oak wood. So, um, oh, I know exactly what I wanted to do today. I think my quest for today is to finish making my house with lots of glass. So it has like a strip of glass all around it like this. So I might need to get rid of this tree. At least get rid of this strip of tree. A pretty big tree. Try to break it as much as possible. Okay. So, without further ado, I will go and get some sand. Now, one of the easiest ways to break sand is with your shovel. I mean, it makes sense when gathering sand. Say, at like the beach, you normally use a shovel to you know scoop it up I mean you don't want to use a sword or a pickaxe to try to get through sand I mean you could use your hand but it's so much easier just to use a shovel to pick up something that is that grainy I think yep I did make myself a stone shovel so that's gonna be easier and also one of the cool things with uh, the snow on top if you hit the snow with the shovel you get a snowball! Actually, I think you get like two. Yeah, you got two. And with the snowballs, you can throw them. Apparently, I'm throwing them right into the lava pit. Um. Okay, let's go see if that's enough glass. It looks like it's starting to get dark now. So, let's just head inside. And we'll throw our see Ooh, we already got some glass here. Oh yeah, when we were making the other stuff before, let's throw our glass in there. Throw some coal up there. And it looks like the sun is going down. Let's see if we yep, we can go to bed. So I've noticed that, you know, most of my videos so far well, I've only made two, but my videos have been very um bland. I mean, it's understandable to have a pretty bland video, mostly for the fact that, you know, it's only my first few videos and I'm bound to start doing some exciting things and there's a lot of like exciting um, ideas I've come up with so far that I want to do with this that does involve a lot of like my subscribers and it involves my um, you know, if people leave comments, and it's going to be fairly similar in a way to like Stampy's Love Garden, but it's not going to be a love garden. It's going to be something different, so I'm not exactly mimicking Stampy with what he does, but it is going to be something to represent you guys. So that you guys can feel part of the videos. I'm not exactly sure. I mean, I think with hitting the tall grass, you're just going to get some seeds every now and then. And then, I'm not sure if there is a uh, specific tool that will help you get them more. And 
and I do have some pretty big plans for the house that I have been building and I do want like a little plot of area, plot of land that I do want to kind of have some um, like a little tiny like farming area. I feel bad for leaving all these holes. I think those are all the holes I've made. Okay, so... And... I think these flowers do make a yellow dye. Not a hundred percent sure, but I do think that they might. So I guess I'll head back on over. Get more of this yellow, because I'm thinking about doing a uh, carpeting in um, the dog's house, the little doggy room. I want to do like a nice little carpeting for. You know, for comfort because, you know, I get a bed to sleep on, the dog doesn't get anything to sleep on, so. It, it's, I think all just in fairness. Maybe some red, maybe red and yellow, that's a nice, you know, um, those colors go nice together. I think I'm on the other side of this mountain. And I am. And there's a dog. It might be that dog that I tried to make friends with, but I was unable to because it was super, like, picky. It was, you know, like, hey, I want more than just one little bit of bone. Whereas the dog that I did make friends with was like, hey, yeah, one bone, this is enough, I'm so happy. Now, the, like I've said in like the previous videos, when dealing with glass, you want to make sure that what you place is what you want to place. Due to the fact that, you know, if you do place glass and you decide that you don't want it there, it will not become anything else when you break it. it, it that, it's a really annoying thing. I mean, I understand, like, once you have glass, once it's broken, it's broken. But, I mean, this is Minecraft. When you break up a piece of, like, uh, like the planks. If you break up a plank, you're, you're not going to, you know, get... A plank. You just used an axe on it. There's obviously no way you're gonna get a whole plank back. I mean, it'd be different if it gave you back a piece of wood, because that's a little more realistic. But, you know, they're the creators. I am not. So, not much I can really say for them. Besides the fact that they don't know what they're doing, that was a complete and total joke. Okay. I mean, it's convenient. I don't have to make these all back into That's convenient. I like convenience. I know this video seems rather boring so far, you know, just watching me break up things but in the end i know you know i don't want to be skipping you guys to be watching all of these things like i want you guys to watch from beginning what happened you know like how did i get to where i will be at and you know that that just it involves you guys having to watch the boring things. I apologize prior to it being super boring, 
but in all honesty, that's life. I'm trying to figure out here. Okay, so that's looking better. I, th I like that. I think that looks nice. Very elegant. If I do say so myself. Okay, so I want to pull this stuff out of here. Because I want to actually move this. Whoop. Okay. And that involves replacing that with that. Now I might as well break the bed and switch this stuff up over here. And put the bed back down. Okay. A rather small room, I know. But Oh crap, I forgot I had a whole bunch of stuff. Put that there. Stuff in there that I don't need. Silly fuzzy. Thought to myself, hey, I need, you know, to put all this stuff in there. And you kind of just threw it all. I think that might be everything. I was just not thinking whatsoever. Okay, so now my whole entire floor is back to being normal. There. That looks better. Okay. That, not so much. I like it. I like it a lot. That way my dog can be close to me. I have my room. I eventually do want to extend it all. Now I think I want to move the door to here. Uh, not to here. Silly placement. To like here. There we go. That looks a lot better. I am pretty content and happy with my house. <clears throat> now I just, I keep reminding myself that one day this lava pit will be useful to me. And now that I see it is getting dark, um, what do I do with my torches? Okay, so now that I see it's getting dark, I should lighten up his room. I don't know why, but I do believe that the doggy is a boy. Okay, gather up some of these. Okay. Now let's go and see about pull oop, not the eggs. I didn't want them. Let's go to the crafting table and see we can make dandelion yellow for dye. And we could do rose red. Okay. Okay, so... Oh, I don't have any wool on me. Haha. <laughs> I don't know if you can also use black and gray wool. Or... Oop. Let's do some yellow. Whoa. -oh. 
Well, I definitely can't do red now. <laughs> okay. Okay, so let's see. Let's do some yellow carpeting here. So, how about let's try to make the pattern that I do want to make. Started. Not finished, but started. <clears throat> I like the glass in this texture pack because it's a lot easier to see out of. Like, there's been some that we've had and it just looked like really blurred to look out of. But with this, you know, you can mostly see out of it. So, I think to end my. This night, let's head to bed. Okay. Now let's go see if there's some sheep out and around so I can maybe at least make the few bits of um, red carpeting so that I could finish up the dog's room. Oh, let's see. Cow, I don't need a cow, I don't need a pig. Where are all the sheep? Excuse me, cow. I do not know how to apparently get up here. Okay, there we go. Now let's see if we can find ourselves some sheep. Oh, there's one. Okay. Oh, you're a cow. It'd be nice to get, you know, to eventually make some shears so I don't have to go around killing sheep. I could just go and, um, just, uh, you know, shear them. They'll look naked and kind of funny for a little bit, but once they eat, their uh, wool should grow back. Pretty sure that's how it works. I think it's after they eat. Oh, look at the little chicken. Aww. Okay, so... Hmm. Hey, cactus! Huh. A whole big desert. <clears throat> that could, I think cactus ends up making a green dye. So who knows, maybe I'll end up making some green dye. Or I could use some of this and I can grow it. Because just laying down one next to water and on sand will give you more cactus. That sounds like a good idea to me. I don't know about you guys, but I think growing cactus sounds fun. And sugarcane. I don't know what I'm gonna need sugarcane for yet. I think that, you know, they make paper which would help with making books. But I think having sugarcane and cactus on hand will only benefit me. Huh. What's that weird structure underwater over here? I don't know, maybe it's just uh, it f fading. But I do think I spy a sheep. Oh, another lava pit? Huh. That is pretty cool. So apparently they're not as rare as I thought that they were. Oh 
Okay, so how many? I got three white. I need more than just three. I think I need at least four. Hopefully this is a sheep and not a pig. Sheep and not a- oh, it's a pig. Okay, well, I think that once I get back home, this is going to conclude for my, my video for today. Let's see, where am I? I think I need to go this way a little bit. Okay. Let's see. I guess we'll finish up the carpeting next video. Let's go over this mountain here. Oh wait, maybe there's a sheep. Oh, I think you're white wool. Yay! I might have enough to finish up the carpeting. And I fell. Oh, and it looks like I'm really hungry. That would explain why I'm unable to run. Fill up our tummy. And see if home is on the other side of here. And it is. And I fell. Okay, let's just do a quick change in, in color. Now I do red, there we go. I'm gonna head over here and see if I can do some red carpeting. Okay, let's see, we got six. That should be enough. And now he has a pretty snazzy room. Whoop! Did not mean to do that. Oh! <laughs> Apparently I forgot how to color coordinate correctly. There. That looks fun. Okay, well... I guess this is, I'm going to wrap up this video for today, and I hope you guys had fun, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!